Welcome to channel 69, and you have Big Hurt with the Ghetto Report. Big Hurt, back with the Ghetto Report. We represent State Fly Nation, you know what it is. We'll jump right into it, talk about Donald Trump, the Donald. So Donald Trump's trial just started in New York City. He got a civil fraud trial based on him inflating the value of his property. New York Attorney General Tina James, she brought a $250 million civil fraud case against ex-president, and he's in New York now on trial. We, we don't know what's gonna be the outcome of that case, but he did out for a judge trial as opposed to a jury trial. A lot of people like to go with the judge trial because they believe that a judge will be more fair and they'll go by the letter of the law. I don't know how that's gonna work in the Donald case. So everybody knows that you kind of inflated those joints. They even looked at it and Donald actually said himself, he said that his property is worth whatever he says it's worth. That's like me saying, this ice pick here is worth $2 million. I was like, it's not worth $2 million. I paid two twenty five dollars for it. Anyway, if we gonna go with what the Donald said, you can say whatever your property's worth is what you say it's worth. I don't think he's gonna be successful in that trial. But hey, if he thinks he is, good luck to you. Donald's gonna travel and stay tuned. As crazy as it is, he thinks he's gonna beat it. But good luck with that all. And that you can say the property's worth whatever it is. We wanna shout out Jay-Z and his mom. The New York City Mayor Eric Adams, who is the hip hop mayor, just recently honored them at a open public library gala. He honored them. I think that's a good look for hip hop. And I'll say that I guess he is New York City hip hop man, if he recognizes Jay-Z and his moms for their contributions to hip hop and philanthropy. Well, that was a good look. Now, Childish Gambino. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. What's up, it's Big Herb. I don't know if y'all heard about my journaling course for the kids, but I'm doing the journaling course. And you should sign up real quick if you want your kids to be a writer. Just in case they want to be a rapper, that's too. They can, just, they can learn how to rap with this course too. You know, Manny Fresh said that Juvie wrote the greatest love song ever written. Back that ass up, kids. They can write the next greatest love song ever written. Join Big Herb's journaling course. They in the trend. Greatest love song ever written. You heard from Big Herb first. Big Herb, I'm out. He recently shut down rumors of his retirement. So they were saying he was retiring. You know, he had movies and all that, making movies. They figured that he was gonna retire from music. So he teased new music and he shut down rumors that he was gonna retire and he's not gonna retire. But we should be looking for new music from Childish Gambino real soon. Now I wanna talk about Cardi B, who recently said that she's about to shut down the internet and all the haters with receipts. Cardi, please the receipts. Shut it down. Don't hold back. Let loose, Cardi. Shut it down. I wanna conclude with Diddy, who made predictions about him predicting the next hip hop billionaire. That's a slippery slope right there. It's hard to predict who won't be a billionaire because this thing go left and right. You see what happened to Ye, he predicted him and he fell. Bruh. But I think it'd be easier if Diddy predict the next millionaire. So that way if he falls short, he can give him all a mill on the low. Who would be wiser? I think that'd be a safer prediction, Diddy, than predicting who's the next billionaire. Because listen, I predicted Ye and he's not a billionaire anymore. Anyway, that was another edition of the Ghetto Report with Big Hurt. Stay tuned next week and we're gonna come back at you. Big Hurt and I'm out. Hold up, hold up y'all, I need one second. Easy, 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 you know, king of the snap benefits. I'm back, easy key, I got the Bluetooth gun. This is the last one left, I had 35. They fell off the back of a truck. You know how it go, this is the last one. This one for $25, holler at easy peasy. I take snap benefits, I take everything, food stamps, whatever, change. They like that car money, easy, take change and all that. Easy peasy, holler at me, this is the last one left, $20. I'm out, easy peasy. Stop up by the door, I want those headsets.